a wild ride in crypto land for the past several months. Sure has. Now that you're on the cusp of taking Galaxy public and Bitcoin is back at $8,000, thereabouts, how do you feel about the prospects for this industry? I feel great. You know, it's, there's been like kind of a tale of two cities that have been going on. On the one hand, you know, the Canadian crypto markets, public companies have traded poorly, and crypto in general has traded soft up until recently. On the other hand, the private markets uh, for ICOs, for private equity transactions, are a raging bull market. Tons of money are pouring into uh, venture capital funds. You know, Silicon Valley has become Crypto Valley. In some Why degrees. the disparity? You know, part of it is it's easier for an institution to make a bet in an illiquid venture fund than it is for them to buy coins. We don't have custody that they trust yet. Coins are volatile. Listen, if you had bought coins three months ago, you don't look so smart. They're down. And if you had put money in Andreessen's fund, yeah, you're still marked to market at zero uh, or at flat. And so it's just an easier first step into it. Uh, you also have lots of money that's been raised uh, are made by the coin bases, by Block One, by Wobi, and you haven't even heard of some of these places. They have huge war chests. So they're bidding for crypto assets. Uh, and so I'd say it's a raging bull market in privates. I'd say it's a raging bull market in people that are coming into the space. If you look at a graph of people entering the space, it's straight up. And the talent entering the space is straight up. And I'd say it's a bull market at conferences. I just came back from Hong Kong. There were 15,000 people at Rise Hong Kong. Uh, I was at Beyond Blocks in Seoul, and I must have had my selfie taken 50 times. So you leave me with an obvious question. So he brings up a great point, and that's why I'm happy to be sharing this interview, that yes, the price of crypto has been dead, but the interest, the people entering the space, the talent that's coming into cryptocurrency, that is what is growing. And that's what you guys should be paying attention to. And like I said, it's uh, growth is going to go up. So yes, right now, um, the price has been low, it's been flat. And yes, we were in a bubble, but it's not going to stay down forever. Uh, more and more people are entering this space. There's numerous use cases, and I'll be posting more stuff, content like that, to kind of go on this deep dive. But Mike Novogratz is a great interview. Um, brings up a great point that right now it's easier for uh, money to flow into these private ventures than the coins. Um, and that's eventually going to change. And uh, for me, if you've been following my previous content, I always have recommended that you stay in the top 10 because some of these private coins or smaller coins, it's, it's still very, very volatile. But um, let me know your thoughts on this, and I will talk to you guys soon.